everybody, this is Rick coming to you from Everyday Preppers. Today I uh, picked up a little item from the Boy Scouts of America uh, local chapter. We have one of the uh, largest in my area of the Boy Scout main offices. <clears throat> Excuse me. And I was looking for a new cook kit uh, that I wanted to use. I specifically was kind of looking for this little pot that I wanted to uh, to use with some tests I want to do with my alcohol stoves, cat can stove, transgia stove, and they don't really sell this pot by itself. They sell it as a kit, and the kit was under ten dollars. And as a former scout myself, former member of Order of the Arrow, uh, I knew early on when I was a Cub Scout. Uh, the importance of scouting and what you can learn and how to be prepared and that kind of led me into uh, a lifelong career of being prepared in my life I don't say a career but it led me into learning about preparedness preparing myself for different situations and kind of was the early stages of me learning about life and this little cook pot set was one of the first things that I remember in scouting and uh, carried it on countless trips all across the southeast. And today I wanted to share and see if it's the same type cook set that I remember. Uh, it's got the Boy Scout logo right here. Uh, I'm looking at the box. Don't quite know. It's got a little Spanish words up here. And it does say Boy Scouts of America there. It's got the symbol. Let me look around. It's got Boy Scouts of America on the back. The Boy Scout logo. But this is kind of interesting. Boy Scouts of America logo stamp. But it says made in China. So let's unveil this thing. and Let's see if it's the same thing that I remember. comes in a little netting pouch. Looks like something like some kind of weird netting. The handle's different than the one that I remember. Um, does have the skillet. The skillet's a little bit smaller but deeper. This is a, a little bit deeper version of the one that I remember. What do we have here? Here's the pot that I was looking for. Comes with a little plastic cup. Nondescript kind of cup. Here's the pot. Ironically, it does not have the Boy Scout logo on it that I remember. Uh, I think you can still probably find some of those in flea markets and yard sales, I'm sure, and I'm pretty positive you can probably find almost anything on eBay. But uh, still fits the same, still the same kind of tin material. The uh, I don't know what to think about this handle. I don't know how you're supposed to, it looks like it's upside down, I don't know how you're supposed to use it. Uh, do you, I don't know how you're supposed to use this thing. Seems like it's backwards. I mean, if I put that one, this is supposed to be a cooking skillet, and it's got rubber right here. So that's the first thing it's going to melt off. So I don't know how you're I don't, I really. I mean, how, how, how do you use that in a fire? I mean, I, I really don't really don't comprehend how you're supposed to use this thing in a fire. It doesn't fold. As you can tell, it doesn't doesn't lay flat. It lays kind of cattywampus. I, I don't know what you're supposed to do with this. Uh, it's strange that the Boy Scouts would put their stamp on something that's not. Not anything up to their standards, but uh, like I said, that doesn't lay flat, and the first thing that rubber's going to do is burn off. I guess you could use this on the fire. 
then how are you going to pick it up and move it? So, I don't know. I mean, overall, I'm not too impressed with it. Uh, I, I, I do like the pot. Thank goodness it does not have a plastic ring. But the ring, this is tin, but the ring itself is not tin. So I don't know what that's made out of, but it looks like some kind of shiny chrome uh, material. But the, uh, it appears to nest similar to the old cook set. Although I remember the cook set that I had See, that doesn't that doesn't nest like it's supposed to. I don't know if I can make it go over or not. There's there's nothing similar to me. Oh, that's stuck now. There's nothing similar to the original Boy Scout stamped old cook set from the 70s, 60s, 70s, and 80s that I remember. So. Uh, I mean, I guess that'll still work. You just have to figure out how to use the skillet. Cause I just, I, for the life of me, maybe somebody on YouTube can tell me what the purpose of this handle that doesn't fold flat is and the purpose of the rubber plastic. Uh, that feels like rubber. It almost feels like plastic dip. Uh, if I was going to use that, I guess the first thing I would do would probably cut that off. Uh, I took that off. I don't know what that means. I'll put that back on that way. That won't work. If I put it on that way, that ain't going to work. I don't know. I don't know what to tell you, folks. Uh, if anybody's got any suggestions about this, please share them with me and let me know. And then uh, we can go forward. We can go forward from there. Is that fair? So there you go. There's a... Uh, there's what they're calling the Boy Scout kit now. And uh, the cook kit, that's what they're calling it now. So I don't I don't know what to say. Uh, I, I'm sure it'll work. I'm sure it'll function well, except for the skillet. I just don't know what to say about the skillet. But aside from that, it's made out of tin. Uh, it'll still work for the, for the purpose. The pot will still work and the skillet will work or the little plate will work. Uh, coming from, you know, Boy Scouts of America and made in China, I don't, I don't know what to say about that either. So thank you for your, uh, for visiting our page. Thank you for checking out our videos. And if anybody's got any comments regarding this, I, and let me just say this as a disclaimer. I love Boy Scouts of America. I was a Cub Scout. I was a Boy Scout. I was in the Order of the Arrow. I'm a firm believer in Boy Scouts. I'm a firm believer in scouting as a whole, uh, being prepared and learning. I'm just not very fond of this cook set and uh, what they're trying to represent here. Uh, so, like I said, leave your comments below. Please uh, give me a thumbs up on this video if you like this video and like our review of it. And uh, make sure you hit the subscribe button, okay? Thank you so much and we'll talk to you soon.